Sharpie, no. We just don't label it and um, it'll be more fun later. been packing for a while now um and I thought the kitchen was gonna be like quick you know like I have some mug I've got some tea I've got a little bit of like random food dude I have so much stuff I have freaking appliances I have cookbooks I have I forgot how much I had and I'm glad I'm not doing this the day before I move like I was planning to update my mom is taking a shower and my brother went home and my dad is wonderful and he is bringing my donations to Goodwill <laughs> that I've had for literally ever and I keep forgetting to bring. So he is doing that. So I am semi alone for the moment and I feel like that will be rare from here on out. Moving isn't fun. I had to say goodbye to Akira today and um, I love her a lot. So tomorrow morning we are getting up early and driving very far south. Basically it's almost as far south as you can get in the United States kind of. That's a lie but it's very far from me so it's gonna be a lot warmer and um, get to hang out with my sister more which is great and my parents and I'm not looking forward to the drive because my cat. He is very um, claustrophobic and so I got him a big dog kennel which is over there to put in the car so that it wouldn't be such a big deal for him. Um, so he'd have lots of room and I'm gonna put his favorite blanket in there but I'm not confident that he's gonna do well so we shall see. It's gonna be weird. I didn't like leaving work, but my coworkers surprised me with a bunch of presents, including this beautiful necklace 
and they could not have been sweeter. Hopefully the future will bring good things. And back to the vlog. It's time! It's go time! I think I'm successful because uh, Yuri is chill right now. Like he's not flipping out or anything. Do you know how rare that is? Hi buddy! It's adventure time. There's no way I'm vlogging this whole trip because this is a seven and a half hour drive without stops, which means that like when we stop, it's gonna be like nine hours. So, well I hope not that long, oh dear lord. This is a momentous occasion. I've never made a move this big, at least not by myself. Brief update, so my car, um, as you know, I'm driving very far south and my car decided not to turn the air conditioning on. Um, it had been about 20, 30 minutes without any air. It actually it had been probably closer to 30 or 40. And um, me and this one, especially this one, honestly, I could have done it with both windows down, but um, he was having a rough moment there. Uh, he was panting and miserable and it really wasn't fair. So my mom and I switched cars. So I am now driving a minivan with my mattress in it. And the cat is thoroughly enjoying this a lot more. So I think we're gonna stick like this for a while longer. I don't know if we'll do this the rest of the way. We've got about two and a half-ish hours left. We might just stick around like this, who knows. But we will catch up with you later. have been here for about two months. I have been here for about two months. My family has been here longer, but um, I moved a little bit late because I wanted to finish up what I needed to do at my previous job and I really didn't want to leave Akira and everybody that soon. So here we are. I know nobody was really waiting for it, but I wanted to do a moving vlog because this was the first big move that I've ever done. And uh, yeah, also I think I look really cute today hope somebody watches this because it was a lot of fun to make and I really like it here so far. This is a smaller town. I have never lived in a town this small that I can remember. I may have when I was like really little but I definitely do not remember it. So this has been an experience but honestly like everything that you need is here. Like you may not have you know a Starbucks around the corner but we have a couple of really decent coffee shops. They're not they're not quite as good as Starbucks but um, they are very good um, and you know there's little restaurants and local places and if I really want to go to Sephora or go to Starbucks or go somewhere like that um, there's actually a city about an hour and 15 minutes from here and it has Target and it has just everything that you need if you are as basic of a person as me so I do that when I get paid usually and just go get what I need and get Starbucks and get food um, I am in the south I mentioned that 
Whataburger is so good. I had never had that because they didn't have it where I lived before. They don't have it in the middle of the country, uh, really, but where I am now, I'm in the vicinity of Texas, and so now I have it, and it's delicious, like, so good. Their fries, oh my gosh. So it has been an interesting experience, but I hope you guys enjoyed that. Um, I definitely miss Akira. We definitely need to figure out something about filming soon because <sighs> it's just been slightly lonely, although I am much happier here because my family is here and I don't want to be that far from my family. I was about seven and a half, eight hours from them. It was only for a few months, but I hated it. I hated it so much. So I'm glad that I moved. I do miss Akira. I miss sashimi. I miss my coworkers. I do. I miss my life there, but I have a job that I really like here. I have coworkers that I get along with very, very well. Um, I'm the northerner to them. I say weird things and I don't think they're weird things. They think they're weird things. I'm not a southerner, so sue me. See you soon.